essentially if i say uh, for india at the cost of one mission of 700 crores you have essentially given us a full second mission because this experiment of hop would have happened on a second mission would have so yes. double benefit out of one mission it's a question of uh, what are the limitations that are offered by the instruments and capabilities but i am very happy that we could do this it's not just for the demonstrating mission it's actually a confidence to our team here in uh, who built the chandrayaan 3 that the understanding they gave got out of that hope experiment is tremendous i must tell you uh, the ability to reprogram the whole mission do simulations in ground to understand it to get to remove the worries of the mind no we have everybody has mindsets of uh, doing things which are never thought about Correct. i told exploratory missions are of this nature we must uh, track paths which have never been traveled and if you do not have the courage to travel in that path you are not going to make history so in fact i told uh, to my director of uh, urc also this that uh, you unless you take that decision to go on uh, paths which nobody has ever you know went into we are not going to make history i think that Uh, because their courage and conviction they took that decision to do i am very so, happy about so, it so so a double soft landing nearer the south pole of the moon very hard for anybody to replicate now that you have enough you have i am told you have about 90 kilograms of fuel left and if it if it wakes up great if it doesn't you can still do a hop because the fuel will not go anywhere now there are many challenges which i will not discuss here it's not like that fuel is still there there can many things can go wrong while it is in such a low temperature there are possibilities of re- freezing of the liquid to very high low temperature which you need huge amount of energy to bring back to liquid stage we will have to see how there everywhere it is liquid still not crystal solvent behind and if you fire it with the, those crystals there the propulsion system will fail there are problems of electronic circuits getting damaged because all materials may not be compatible for low temperature low temperature so there could be power failures there can be intermittency and some of those uh, you know um, uh, corruption would have happened in the software we would not know when you under extremely low temperatures battery would have gone bad